You've bombed that drive out there 300 yards. Couldn't have hit it any better. You're in the middle of the fairway. You've got 125 yards to the hole. Now comes the hard part. We don't want to make that same big old driver swing with this shot right here. We want to control the ball flight, control the spin, control the trajectory. Fran, walk us through how it works for you. What I see in a lot of pro-ams that I play is a lot of very accomplished amateur players get in there and because they're 120 yards, they rip out their gap wedge and they want to say they hit the gap wedge and they launch this thing way up in the air. Therefore, they lose some of their distance control, some of the flight, and therefore there's a huge disparity in the consistency of the golf shot hit. What I like to see is you to take a pitching wedge from 120 yards, basically you might take a smaller, smaller golf swing with less arm swing, less arm speed, and we're going to flight the golf ball. How do we do that? We're not going to get in with the big stance. We're going to get in with a little smaller stance, a little bit narrower. We're going to, again, principles, okay, you're going to get yourself balanced. You're going to have the sternum center. But again, this is only armpit to armpit. So if you watch this, that's armpit to armpit, the ball starting down my target line and it's maintaining a flight that will be effective. The ball will always go relatively the same distance, and that's what I feel like you see out of a good professional. Nice job, friend. A lot of amateurs have a really hard time believing when we show them on video that their swing is as long as it is. They, they feel it's short, but it just isn't. Take out that iPhone, tape your swing, take a look at it, and you're gonna find that if you can keep it armpit to armpit, rib cage to rib cage, you're going to dial in those short irons and you're going to be able to take advantage of that 300 yard drive. Love it. Length is great off the tee. Short is better with the short irons.